Shen Wu's process of transforming municipal solid waste to efficient oil, gas, and coal field. Mankind now is facing huge pressure from energy and environmental problems. The energy mainly refers to fossil energy, including coal, petroleum, and natural gas, etc., which is exhausting. To relieve this pressure, Shen Wu launches its technology of transforming municipal solid waste to efficient oil, gas, and coal field for obtaining fuel oil, fuel gas, and solid carbon from the municipal solid waste via pyrolysis process to supplement and substitute Chinese petroleum, natural gas, and coal resources rather than direct exploitation of conventional petroleum, natural gas, and coal resources. Waste excess and energy insufficient are coordinated organically. The new heat carrier-free regenerative rotating bed carbonization and pyrolysis process invented by Shen Wu is a pioneer worldwide. This process adopts the regenerative radiant tube heating technology and rotating bed pyrolysis technology with independent intellectual property rights and works under normal pressure to realize partial gasification and liquefaction of municipal solid waste to produce high purity and high calorific value fuel gas, fuel oil, and solid carbon in a clean way, which needs neither hydrogenation nor oxygenation. It can facilitate the storage, transportation and sales, power generation and deep processing. Harmful gas, such as dioxin, is not generated and wastewater is not discharged during the whole production. Main characteristics of Shen Wu's heat carrier-free regenerative rotating bed pyrolysis process. 1. Over 30 to 1500 tons per day treatment capacity from single furnace, either suitable for small-scale individual municipal solid waste material treatment or large-scale centralized processing. 2. Dioxin and acid gas are not generated during pyrolysis process. 3. The quality of pyrolysis fuel gas generated has high purity and calorific value, which can reach above 3000 kcal per cubic meter. 4. The fuel with low low calorific value, equal to or less than 700 kcal per cubic meter, can be used as heating fuel and the high quality pyrolysis gas can be completely replaced to substitute the natural gas or served as the high quality chemical material. 5. The pyrolysis furnace is with a high efficiency of above 80%. It is far better than the conversion efficiency of municipal solid waste incineration power generation, which is below 22%. The municipal solid waste raw material collected will be processed with bag breaking, screening and separating to remove inorganic substance. The residual organics will be processed with crushing and molding before going to feedstock bin for storage. The feedstocks are continuously sent to the rotating bed via the feeder and are uniformly distributed on the furnace hearth of rotating bed via the distribution device. The pyrolysis gas generated in the furnace enters into the cooling column via gas pipeline. The cooled non-condensing gas is sent into the fuel gas storage tank after purifying procedures. The sewage generated during oil and water separation is recycled and the remaining sewage is sent to sewage treatment unit. The cooled oily water enters into the separation column where the synthetic petroleum is generated and the synthetic crude is sent to the crude storage tank. Inside the rotating bed carbonation furnace, the roof and wall are kept stationary while the stock will rotate with the furnace hearth. The regenerative radiant tube burner will heat the stock. The stock can be pyrolyzed to solid carbon and discharged from the discharging port in a sealed way. The water mist cooling is adopted to cool the high temperature biomass. The generated steam will be released after heat recovery and dust removal. The pyrolysis gas generated from this process is rich in hydrogen, methane and carbon monoxide 
with low heating value, about 3,000 kcal per cubic meter, which can be substituted natural gas or served as chemical material. The bio-oil generated has a calorific value between 5,000 to 8,000 kcal per kilogram, which can supplement and substitute petroleum. The solid carbon generated has a calorific value over 3,000 kcal per kilogram, which can be supplement and substitute fuel for coal. The main treatment methods of municipal solid waste are landfill and incineration power generation in China. This not only occupies plow land, but also pollutes atmosphere and underground water. Meanwhile, emission of dioxin and acidic gas remains to be solved. High cost in material gathering and transportation is also a difficult problem. The distributed clean energy station, launched by Shenwu, can be built a small-scale regional pyrolysis treatment station in villages and towns to provide the high calorific value energies for local use or for deep processing via storage and transportation that realize small-scale oil, gas, and coal field of villages and towns. Fuel gas, 12,000 cubic meters per day. Fuel oil, 7 tons per day and solid carbon, 20 tons per day, are obtained if 50 tons municipal solid waste are treated every day. Annual capacity of municipal solid waste is above 150 million tons in China and can reach 210 million tons by 2020. The discharge amount of waste, biomass, animal and plant bodies, excrement, etc. in the vast rural areas is big. By adopting Shenwu's transforming municipal solid waste to efficient oil, gas and coal field technology, above 6 billion cubic meters natural gas substitute level, above 10 million tons petroleum substitute fuel, and above 70 million tons coal substitute fuel are obtained from municipal solid waste in China to optimize the economic and social value of municipal solid waste reduction, harmless and reclamation.